listening to another episode of Them Bulls. If you haven't already subscribed, make sure you hit the subscribe button so you won't miss out on any updates from my channel. So in this video, we're going to do a quick update on the Chicago Bulls injuries. Some news have came out this week regarding Dizza Valentine and Lori Marketing. So let's get into it. So the Chicago Bulls announced on Monday that Denzel Valentine will undergo surgery on November 26th. He will be having reconstructive surgery on the ankle that he tweaked in practice before the season started. This will be Denzel's third surgery, which does seem to have a lot of fans worried. But what should put your worries to rest is that the same doctor who operated on Steph Curry's ankle when Steph was having problems with his ankle last season is going to be the same doctor who is going to operate on Denzel Valentine's ankle too. The timeline for Denzel's recovery will be four to six months, which is basically the entire season, but we as Bulls fans knew he wasn't coming back since the Bulls have kept everything surrounding this injury very much under wraps in private. If you guys are fans of reading articles like me, I strongly suggest you guys go read the Chicago Tribune article by Casey Johnson where he interviewed Delta Valentine asked him, you know, his mindset of going into the surgery. In the article, he was very upbeat and has found the silver lining in this that he will have more stability in his ankle and also have a full year to recover instead of trying to come back after a surgery. I know a lot of you guys have given up on Denzel Valentine. Every time I mention his name on this channel, I get a lot of hate in the comments about Denzel, but I have not given up on him. You know, I hope he has a successful surgery and just looking at this team right now, we definitely need him and you can tell where he's missing. So moving on to the most anticipated comeback that us Bulls fans are looking forward to, Lori Marketing. We finally have an update and a timeline on when he's supposed to come back. So as we all know, Lori suffered a high grade lateral sprain in his right elbow while battling for a rebound in the first week of training camp and he was ruled out for six to eight weeks. Tomorrow, November 22nd, will make eight weeks. But it doesn't look like he's coming back for the next couple of games, and it's looking like it will be 10 weeks. That said, Lori has been participating in non-contact practices with the Bulls, and the video was showed of him dunking in practice, and him shooting around and shooting some threes. The countdown is now on because he isn't wearing his brace, and I'm estimating that he will be back around mid-December sometime. I want Lori to take all the time he needs. There is no reason for him to rush back and not be fully recovered. Yes, I'm excited to see him play, of course, but he needs to go through conditioning again. All the muscle gain, muscle definition that he had in all season needs to be worked on since he hasn't been playing or been able to work out. Once Lori comes back, we will start winning more games. And for those of you who are actively rooting for a tank, you guys should want Lori to stay out as long as possible. So Zach Levine, of course, is not injured, but he was out last game with an illness. But news came out today that he will be playing in tonight's game against Phoenix. So that is it for this video. Make sure you guys leave your comments below and your thoughts about the injury updates. Tonight's game will be against Phoenix, and I am excited to see Wendell Carter Jr. and Aiden face off against each other. Leave your predictions for tonight's game. I think that the Bulls are going to win, but if they don't, doesn't even matter anymore. We are just watching these games now just to see improvement from our players, win or lose. So leave your comments below and make sure you're subscribed because I have a lot of updates coming to the channel and I do not want you guys to miss out. And I will see you guys in my next video. Thanks so much for watching.